He's scaring me. He's scaring you. Oh. <laughs> Harry Potter? Is that what this is about? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh man. You can stand on the table if you want to. Stand on the table. Yeah, just stand on the table if you want. We need you up in the air. That's good, yeah. There we go. That's better. You should come this way. Okay. Wait, hold on. shallow complexions, their beady eyes and scaly, waxy skin, their awkward and lumbering shape. Clearly, the higher positions of government and the exclusive ranks of the affluent elite have been infiltrated by reptilian aliens. These insufferable, blood-drinking, shape-shifting reptilian humanoids from the Alpha Dracona star system to suppress and control the human race to the point of world domination. No one on earth but the Illuminati. They established themselves during the age of the first pharaoh in ancient Egypt and consist of 13 ruling families led by the Pindar or Venus of the Dragon. <laughs> resides in the inner earth, down in the hollow interior of the earth, known as Agartha, accessible through cave systems below Area 51, Mount Shasta, Mount Rainier, among others. The Pindar presides over the other 12 Illuminati families, including the Kennedys, Rockefellers, Romanovs, Windsors, and other well-known surnames. Their insidious agenda is propagated by 300 hybrid servants known as the Committee of 300. Comprised of such notable names as Carnegie, Coolidge, Bush, Ford, Roosevelt, Oppenheimer, Obama, and many others, they carry out their barbaric <laughs> short-sighted schemes in the, on the human civilization of the moment until it unerringly implodes on itself to its ultimate demise. Unlike Atlantean, like the Atlanteans and Lemurians before us, our civilization rushes towards its imminent implosion point, completely oblivious to its own destruction. Unlike its vastly more enlightened predecessors, like the Illuminati say in this round of human exploitation, Best slaves are those who aren't aware that they are slaves at all. The 13 ruling families constantly vie for control amongst each other. 
And here is the Committee of 300 to facilitate wars, famine, disease, and other forms of mass genocide without recourse. Their complete lack of morality renders these atrocities as entertainment and is further characterized by their lust for human blood. Sated in underground ritual orgies using human abductees, most often children and babies. Bohemian Grove is a more publicized version of these events, but the most horrendous gatherings occur within their elaborate cave systems. The Illuminati established the United States with 13 colonies, one for each of the ruling families. Now they approach complete global domination. We have shamelessly adopted their lifestyles and thought patterns. We support their horrific agenda with our apathy and complacency. We will live to regret it with every fiber of our being. For by the time we have nothing left to lose, we will have already lost it all. And nothing will stand in their way. Our only hope will be for them to destroy themselves with their own reckless pursuit of gain, allowing the sparse survivors to rebuild society once again. Maybe next time we'll be less tolerant of the deceptive, self-serving tactics, tactics of invasive alien species from distant star systems. Only time and rivers of blood will tell the tale our future human history. Thank you.